everyone. I uh, just wanted to share an upgrade I made to my Kalito Sniper M2 coffee roaster. I have the standard edition, which typically doesn't allow for um, hooking up to Artisan without um, an additional uh, product. And I wanted that ability. I wanted to be able to monitor and uh, save my roast profiles in Artisan uh, so that I could look back and uh, you know store those profiles for future reference. And so typically with the regular Sniper M2 standard edition, which I have, the only way to monitor your roast is through the um, uh, touch screen that is provided with the unit. And it's great. There's no issues with it at all. And it works really well. Um, you can change the, the stir rate of the, the drum, or basically the spin rate of the drum. You can change the, the temperature, um, discharge the smoke, uh, cooling the beans once you drop them, um, timing your roast, all of that is fine. Um, I just wanted the ability to hook it up into Artisan. And so I had a fidget lying around, um, which is basically just a temperature probe from a hive roaster that I, that I had from before. And I just basically co-opted that fidget uh, for use with this uh, Kalito uh, roaster. So if anybody else is looking to do the same thing, uh, the fidget, uh, I just have a, uh, a one channel fidget uh, just for temperature. And uh, those run about 35 bucks. The temperature probe that I uh, purchased was about 12 bucks through Amazon. And I'll go ahead and uh, put a link to that as well. And um, that's pretty much about it. Once you have those parts, uh, it's pretty easy to install, and I'll show you where I did that in a second. And then you can hook up to Artisan and monitor the uh, temperature of the of the beans. Now, if you wanted to get a four-channel uh, fidget, you could monitor the environmental temperature as well as the bean temperature. Uh, but I am just doing the bean temperature at this point. And so to show you where you do that, um, inside each of these little stars is a hex screw. And you basically just uh, undo those, and this unit right here will pull right off. And then um, right there, the one on the bottom is the probe that is standard. That's where that's what hooks up through the um, coffee roaster itself, and um, allows for the device to be controlled with the touch panel. The port on top is blank. And that's where I inserted the temperature probe from my fidget. And then that runs directly into Artisan. And that's great. So I'm not looking to control it through Artisan. I just want to be able to save my roast profile uh, to reference back to it at another time. That's all I wanted to show you. If you have any questions, uh, feel free to um, put them in the comments and I'll try to respond um, as soon as possible.